Give me your project. So my name's Chris King. Uh, I'm from a city called Van Leer, Tennessee, which is about 50 miles west of Nashville. My project is entitled Electromagnetic Levitation, a Digital Control System. Um, basically, I'm constructing an analog device or a series of analog devices leading up to this digital system that's capable of holding, well, what, what is now a balsa wood airplane. And it can hold just about anything that you can fit underneath it that, that fits in a certain weight class, which is about five ounces. Um, so I currently haven't written up too much firmware for it. The firmware is run on an Atmel Mega 128 microcontroller, um, and it's written in C in AVR Studio, compiled and then sent to the actual chip. Um, and of course, there's an LCD screen and some buttons interfaced with it that I used in debugging the system, basically. Um, right now, what it's doing is controlling each channel independently, and there's two Hall effect sensors, one above and one below each electromagnet. And then what basically what it does is it samples the difference between the two sensors, which gives the relative magnetic flux that the actual magnet on the object is exerting on the system. And then that information is uh, converted to digital, uh, basically digital registers inside the chip. And then the chip is using hardware PWM to output the signals that it needs to control the strength of the magnets. And I get a feedback system set up that is inverse to distance, and that's what you see holding up currently my screwdriver and my plane, and it'll hold up just about anything else you feel like putting under there, provided that you trim the game. So, just about any kind of magnetic object, or even a ferromagnetic object that doesn't inherently have any magnetic properties like what you see there, can be suspended.